All right, so now we're gonna take a look at the uh, EMG James Hatfield pickup, or Hetfield. And so um, uh, I'm gonna have to say right off the bat, I was not an EMG fan until probably a couple years ago when I decided to give guitar a try. This, actually, this guitar was recommended to me uh, for, as a great lead guitar. And so I gave the EMG that was in this guitar a try and it was pretty good. Uh, but then I thought when I read the reviews on the James Hetfield pickup and so um, unfortunately I had to buy the two pack and so it cost me 200 bucks uh, but just for one pickup which I have here in this position. The reason why I can't use the other uh, James Hetfield pickup is because this is a sustainer guitar and this is a sustainer pickup so it has to stay. So anyway, so we're gonna take a look here at the James Hetfield pickup and look, even at a low volume this thing just has lots of bite. <laughs> I, uh, it just so happens that I use the uh, same tuning as Sad But True. So uh, let's give that a listen. And you can see that um, I have this at a uh, pretty low volume. I mean, this is like barely pushing one or right at about one, it's a Friedman amp. And so you can see how much drive this pickup has even at such a low volume as this. Um, the clean sounds decent. Um, it, it, it's, it's an okay clean sound, um, uh, but um, it's, I, I have other guitars I use for the clean sound, but it's not bad. It's not bad at all. So there it is, the clean sound of the James Hitfield pickup. Like I say, I usually use strats for clean sound or acoustics um, when it comes to uh, electric guitars. It's pretty much full tilt with me, and this pickup fills the job. So uh, get one today. Subscribe. Have a great day.